In this sequence, we're going to show you how Sematic PCS7 automatically populates process graphics with symbols which are pre-linked to function blocks in the controller configuration. Based on the controller configuration, PCS7 can automatically create symbols which allow the operator to control and monitor CFC and SFC charts from process pictures. These block symbols are automatically linked to their associated faceplates. Generation of these block symbols and the process for linking a symbol to a faceplate can be executed on demand. However, this function is often selected and carried out during compilation of the operator station. Some preparations have to be made for the block symbols to be created automatically. Because it is not always desirable that faceplates are automatically generated, this function must be explicitly selected for each process graphic. In this example, the function will be selected for Picture 3 in the Unit A folder. The properties of Picture 3 are selected. The function is selected in the Block Symbols tab. Now, the option Derive Block Symbols from the Plant Hierarchy is activated. The dialog is closed. With PCS7, it is possible to create a process graphic hierarchy in the OS for operator navigation which matches the plant hierarchy configured in the controller. The top level in the picture tree hierarchy must correspond to level 2 in the plant hierarchy. The plant hierarchy settings dialog is opened. To determine if the system is set up to automatically generate a hierarchical picture tree, the level 2 of the plant hierarchy must be selected. The setting to derive the picture hierarchy from the plant hierarchy has already been selected. The settings are now completed. With these settings, Sematic PCS7 will automatically generate all block symbols, create them in the corresponding pictures, and connect them with their associated faceplates when the operator station is compiled.